Hey guys, welcome back in my channel. I'm Skila, and in this video, I'm going to react and review my space time fantasy battle with Jean. Jean's musicality is unmatched, and for me, it was a big challenge to find an appropriate answer for his vibe. Let's see what we did, and then I will make a review for some of the key moments in this battle. I've watched this battle, but let's do it again, guys. So unique transition. Guess the time signature, guys. Guys, this battle was a dream for me. It's a clash between two different styles. Ay ay ay. Even though we are so different, I can say that Jean is one of my favorite beatboxers because he's probably the most complete. His voice is so developed. He has some crazy technical patterns, he has good range of bass sounds, and last but not least, his structure and composition skills are just outstanding. Let's review some of the interesting moments. This is 100% musicality and technicality at the same time, precision to the maximum. Guys, just imagine how much work is that. He has some crazy technical patterns. Pay attention on his transitions, Gene always introduced the new parts in a very creative and interesting way. And last but not least, his structure was perfect. Great melodies in the intro, technical build-up, creative transition into a groovy beat, and in the end, he did the same phrase from the beginning. Pfft, lovely. Gene always tells you story when he's beatboxing. He did a whole song just for one minute. Much respect. The idea of this concept was to prepare five routines for five battles. We didn't know what our opponents will do, but I was sure that Gene will finish his round with lip oscillation bass, so I decided this will be good counter in the beginning of my round. This was good and a little bit mystical way to introduce my ideas. For the whole round I used the odd time signature 9-8. Why we call it 9-8? It's because we have 9 notes in each measure. We count it like this. 1-2-1-2-1-2-1-2-3. 1-2-1-2-1-2-1-2-3. <laughs> You 
you can have three groups of three notes or you can have different subdivisions and count it like this one two one two three one two one two one two one two three one two one two one two one two three one two one two one two one two three one two one two or you can have five two three five four three four six four five nine five nine four six nine five two nine five two four and that makes nine eight it will be much easier if I show you. By the way, I did a video for the different time signatures, but let me know if you would like to see tutorial with more detailed explanations. For the peak of my routine, I try to use wider range of different bass sounds. Chest bass, lip rolls, trumpet bass snare, tongue bass, combined with some technical combos in 9-8 of course. Rhythm is main and fundamental part of music. Being a judge in the last 10 years, I'm always trying to be objective and I can tell you that I would consider my round more musical instead of technical. Which means that I would give more points for musicality than technicality. The main idea for all of my beats is to use the technicality in the rhythm. I believe that this will make the ideas more meaningful and that will help me to express myself much better. Much love to Gene, big ups to Swiss Beatbox, check out the original video, link in the description, subscribe to our channels, thanks for watching guys, see you in the next video.